night. The darkness is everywhere, all but hiding the roads of the city, shrouding the golden school, its classrooms, its library. The darkness rules the corridors that connect each of the rooms, a darkness through which it is easy to pass unnoticed and keep going until you arrive where the daylight cannot penetrate. Sulphus. Raph? Lower your voice. Uh, I gotta talk to you. What the heck are you doing in here? I have the formula. You're kidding. How did you get it? Tell me. Evidently, I'm not quite the complete disaster that you thought I was. Raph, you never cease to amaze me. After all this time, I'm only now beginning to know myself. Why are you here? You know why. I told you I have no appetite to help you get inside. You told me that, but I don't believe it. And what makes you say that? Because I know you better than you're willing to admit. Huh? Uh-uh. -oh. I have the formula, and I want to see the face of my real parents. But Raph! We can enter the room of the portraits, you and I. We enter and we go out, and nobody will ever know. Hmm. Hmm. Are you really sure you want to do this? I've never wanted anything more. You can still change your mind, Raph. Because you're an angel. You have the wings and the halo. But I also have this. What are you talking about? Are you really willing to turn your life upside down for a dot on your skin? Behind this door are the portraits of my real parents. I know their true identity. I simply can't stop now. I may never have this chance again, understand? I'll never be happy without knowing the truth. Huh. That's the most angelic thing I've heard in quite a while. Are you with me? Aren't I supposed to be against you? However, this time I'll make an exception. Thanks, pal. One thing. We may become sorry we did this, but you'll repent alone because the devil never repents. We start now. Mm. Casket of the secrets, sanctuary of the earthly ones, room of every portrait, the custodian asks to enter. Casket of the Secrets, Sanctuary of the Earthly Ones, Room of Every Portrait. The Tempter asks to enter. Oh, look at these. Unbelievable. How many portraits are there? Millions and millions. They are the portraits of all the earthly ones. And they continue to increase day after passing day. Yes, there's a portrait for every person, and each portrait shows one thing, freedom. The freedom to be angel-like or like a devil. Look there, I see Andrew's hmm. portrait. 
I would say he shows a devilish expression. You are so full of yourself. He obviously has the face of an angel. And look over there. That's the portrait of Jennifer. And there's one of Edward. Yeah, isn't it so cool? And I can see Matthew and the Glamour Twins over there. All these earthlies had angels and devils. And I would have been glad to be their angel. But I don't see how I'll find the portrait of my parents. Hmm? You will never find them. Huh? <gasps> Raina! Wrath. Ugh. What are you doing here? I'll happily answer your question. Because there are millions of portraits here, you will never find the ones belonging to your parents. But it was you who told me to come here, and that I would find their portraits right away. <laughs> you are just a naive little girl. Hmm. I have used you. Hmm? Hmm. I would never have been able to succeed in entering the room alone. But thanks to the two of you, I am here. You have done all of the really difficult work for me. I just don't know how to thank you, dear. Uh, uh, what do you want with us? You got a problem? Within these portraits are contained the freedom of every earthly one. That freedom, the possibility to choose between good and evil, between the beautiful and the ugly, and between the truth and a deception. As long as the portraits stay in this room, that freedom for every earthly one is safe. But now they'll all be mine. And I will control the terrestrials with none excluded. But why do you care about terrestrials? And why do you need their freedom? You really don't understand? I have evidently overestimated your sense of insight. Spell it out. It's simple. Long ago, the angels and devils condemned me to an unfair eternal imprisonment. So this is my revenge. But that's a matter that is strictly between you and them. Why hurt the Earthlies? The sole purpose for the existence of angels and devils is to help Earthlies choose between good and evil, between the beautiful and the ugly, and between truth and deception. But when the Earthlies will be under my control, they will have no such choices. For you see, I will decide everything for them, and therefore angels and devils will become superfluous, meaningless, and <gasps> useless. Do you understand now? You! You are not going to leave here with a single picture! We won't allow you! Get out of here now, Solfus! You must immediately warn the teachers! Huh. Mm. <laughs> I forbid you to leave this room! She's using some kind of force field! We'll just see if it's got enough force to stop me! Bonnie, fly! Goodness, did you think a display like that was going to have any effect? Her force field is strong, but let's just see how much heat it can withstand. In flame, fly! Deluded child. <laughs> Your pathetic fire could never match the energy of the Black Sphere. If we can't beat her with those powers, I'll have to use my thoughts. Think fly! If I can succeed in overcoming her force fields with my thoughts, I'll be able to get in touch with Uri and have her sound an alarm. But I can't beat her. Even with your thoughts, you cannot escape the awesome power of the Black Sphere. Cursed witch! <sighs> Macro fly! Now I'm gonna beat you senseless! It's not polite to hit a lady. Perhaps you'd rather fight with Malachi. <laughs> <laughs> Careful, Sophus! It's just the two of us. <laughs> 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 
Now I've got you. Zolfus! It's not over yet. What do you think you can do about it? <laughs> How about a little demonstration? <laughs> yeah! Malachi, you don't want to disappoint me. Oh, no, I don't, my lady. It's useless to think you can beat me, because you can't. You talk too much. <laughs> 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 Solfus! Speed fly! Come on and try to get me, you ugly beast! Take this! And this! And also this! Must I do everything myself? Thanks a lot, Raph. I call the power of the Black Spear! I'm not going to let you two spoil my plans. That's much better. And so, now we can start. Uh, right now? There's much to do. We must not lose a precious moment. Start removing the portraits. And how are we supposed to transport them out of here? I suggest you keep your mouth closed and obey my orders. I have thought about everything. But there's one thing, my lady. If we remove the portraits, don't we risk being overcome from a sacrilegious wave? And what makes you think that such a risk exists, Malachi? I don't know how to explain it to you, my lady. It's something I can feel deep down in my stomach. You need not worry, as I have thought about this possibility. We have the Black Sphere. Oh, yes, you're right, my lady. Mm -hmm. Come here, you. Thank you.